moving the crows down to the river as much as possible. It's a project that's been going on for years. Is this the a site. paid position? Yeah. Nice. And you're using the hawk to do that? Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, that's what works. It's a humane way to remove crows from an area. You know, we're not killing them. He just flies up, flies back, and they find somewhere else to sleep. I actually saw it from my... I'm staying at the hotel, at Royal Sinesta, and I saw it from my window. There were all these, like, crows. Yeah. Yeah, it takes us about a month, month and a half to get the crows trained out of a 70 block area. Wow. And uh, then they hold pretty good. They try to creep back in, but... This is really cool. So those lights actually drive them away? Well, he's trained to go to where the hot, where the laser shines. So I shine it up there, he'll fly over there. And then um, the crows learn that where the laser's shining, uh, the hawk is coming. So then they start to learn fear of the laser. Interesting. Nice. So the crows are really smart. They learn our faces when we're walking around. We can walk around without the bird and they will fly off. So, uh, how long have you been doing this? Uh, I've been flying birds for 20 years. But the, re the removal of the crows is uh, how long? This has project it... has been going on for six years. Six years. And how successful has it been? Oh, it works. It works. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. It works pretty good. So. Interesting. So those lights, the, the, the hawk will follow the lights. I gotta go down to the next corner, but yeah. All right, thank you. You too.